Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Dodo MIDI with Native Instruments Contact Software Sampler. Alright, let's start. So we have this uh, thing that I recorded earlier. This is what I'm going to use for this demonstration. And let's start to put Dodo MIDI in this channel. All right. Facts now. Dodo, Dodo MIDI VST. There we are. Now we're gonna put contact. All right. Contact five is loading. Okay, I'm not configuring anything yet. Let's put Dodo MIDI second part. This is the part that controls the volume. Where it is? Here. Dodo MIDI second part. Okay. Uh, now we need to do some configurations. Um, in contact, first we should load the sound. Now the sound that I'm going to use is an uh, organ sound and have it here in vintage organs uh, instruments jazz c3 jazz that's the one i want okay it's loaded but we need to configure it so let's go into the instrument options then it's important to remember to click the group editor and click edit all groups because we want to change all the groups all right next we need to set the pitch band range so we press mod under source and we need to add a pitch band now this uh, particular instrument doesn't have a pitch band by default some of them do we're gonna add it so add modulator external sources pitch band now this is just uh, two semitones uh, we want it to be uh, 24 semitones pitch band range so we'll push it all the way up but as you can see it's just 12 semitones that's not gonna be enough so to fix that we're gonna add, we're gonna add another pitch band modulator so again add modulator external sources pitch band and this one we're gonna push all the way to 12 semitones now we have 24 semitones and now it's going to sound good I hope but first I'm going to show you what I recorded without any effects. I'll turn off all the effects. And this is just a piece of music from uh, Soft Cell. So it sounds like that with my singing without any effects. <laughs> all right, now let's turn on Dodo MIDI and contact. Okay, it sounded a little bit low, so let's push the octave up. Alright, and we can even push another octave up. And that's it. Uh, that's the general principle of how to set up instruments in contact to work with uh, Dodo MIDI. Um, just so it will be clear, I think I'll show you another instrument to use. 
I'll, let's go for a trumpet. So I'll close this one. I'm not gonna save anything. And I have a trumpet in the factory selection. Under um, no, not in the factory selection. In the factory library. Right, it's under orchestral. Uh, there is dogs barking, but that's okay. Uh, brass trumpet. All right, now I'm gonna turn off the reverb because I don't want it for this sound and configure it as usual. All right. Click Group Editor, Edit All Groups. Now let's change. Let's add a pitch bend. So we click Mod Under Source. As you can see, it already has pitch bend, but it's only two semitones. So we're gonna push it up to twelve. And just as before, we're gonna need an, to add another pitch bend because we want twenty-four and not twelve. Pitch bend. Push it all the way up. Now we have two pitch bends with 12 semitones. It's 24 semitones. Okay, I think it will be a little bit high with two octaves up. Let's try just one octave up and listen to it. Alright, uh, that's it for this video. Uh, we, see, we saw how to configure contact to work with uh, Dota MIDI. Uh, thank you.